Most people are shocked to learn that the Bible they grew up with was not translated directly from original Aramaic texts, but rather from Greek versions that were retranslated into English. The Aramaic English New Testament Bible comes directly from Aramaic, the very language spoken by Jesus and his disciples. The Aramaic English New Testament, or AENT, is the most definitive English New Testament in nearly 2,000 years. Comparing Matthew chapter 26 verse 34 in the King James, New International Version and Aramaic English New Testament, the important distinction is not immediately evident. Let's first listen to the King James Version. Jesus said unto him, Verily I say unto thee, that this night before the cock crows, thou shalt deny me thrice. Now let's review the translation found in the New International Version. Truly, I tell you, Jesus answered, this very night before the rooster crows, you will disown me three times. Finally, here is the same verse in the Aramaic English New Testament. Yeshua said to him, Truly, I say to you, that in this night before the cock crows, you will deny me three times. It would appear that all three versions are presenting the same scenario. However, when delving into the original Hebrew and Aramaic text, it's revealed that the word rooster or cock has a special meaning. The temple crier was a gever, Hebrew for cock or rooster. He was responsible for opening the temple before dawn and calling out loudly two or three times to announce early morning prayer services. It is incredible how the purpose of the passage remains unchanged with this new information. What happens, however, is that now we are able to visualize the rich historical context in which this precious moment in history transpired. The Aramaic English New Testament is the most definitive English New Testament translation in nearly 2,000 years. There is simply no other English New Testament Bible that is as authentic and authoritative. Discover the first New Testament, now available in English. The Aramaic English New Testament.